City Steel by Don Domansky. Forgive Me by Mary Oliver. O.T. Span by Libby Davis. Opera by David McGimsey. Once in a while, I remember the place, sulfur and coal. The drive is a wash. People, stake boards. Brother, can you spare a dime? Down to his two tight track pants. The tenor is more or less what you'd expect. Especially if you expect this kind of guy whose greatest moment was killing a pimp in Grand Theft Auto. Dust always moving towards form but never arriving. Company houses. Dark itch of window and door. The high renaissance colors of tailing ponds. Angels are wonderful, but they are so well aloof. He sings Lucky Love, but loses his breath and has to take a nap. It's what I sense in the mud and the roots of the trees. Smell the fair trade. Or the well, or the barn. I mean coffee. Or the rock, with its citron map of lichen. When he gets up, sofa cushions are kicked like field goals, and he wails, I win, bastard, bastardo, I have won. Washing over. Bat. Until we're soaking aroma. Bastardly. That halts my feet and makes my eyes flare. Brother, can you spare a dime? I mean, Tooney. We both grew up there. You went to synagogue, while I leaned on Jesus for a while. Feeling the presence of some spirit. Poetry waiting for us down the line. Some small god. A baritone, the best friend, still in work clothes, mouthful of cheesies. Who abides there. What do you want to do? Wherever you want to go that's cool with me, as long as it's not a bar, restaurant, or the movies. Dogs gotta eat. An art form that began as dog vespers in the empty streets. Homeless and community meet. As blood in the vein. If I were a perfect person, I would be bowing continuously. Upstage, the tenor phones the baritone and they talk about the important things. Brother, can you spare a dime? The rigors of springtime scotch guarding. Million dollar houses. The spread between the ravens and the jets. Memento mori in the mind. And a largely fabricated memoir that takes place at the tough dormitory that involves one of the future stars of Grey's Anatomy and Three Buck Wine. An action-setting duet moves downstage, deep in a tavern with a nautical theme. Heliocentric. Shine. Or bits of thought coming to rest each night. Shine till the blossoms fall. Among fleabane and cracks in the pavement. Don't forget the roots. I'm not. The baritone waits for a pause between arias and says, Have you noticed how country music these days sounds more like Bon Jovi than Merle Haggard? Working class for all. Back then, poetry was our footsteps in the rounds of the day, those little falls through the pulse. The baritone has made this point before. He said it to his parole officer and whoever mans the phone on the show, Wake Up Grimshaw County. The candle power of each one. Though I pause whenever I feel this holiness. Solidarity forever. And the mezzo-soprano have detailed duets, finishing each other's compliments. May Day. Your hair looks amazing in this color. Queer Day. I know your ass, it looks so sexy in jeans. Car Free Day. I know you're reading a Fukuyama, it's preposterously sentimental. Pedal your feet. I know! Brother, can you spare a dime? This rest of the second act is set, strangely, in an Atlanta tiki bar, and the whole thing is mostly the tenor singing about whether he should order a Mai Tai or a surfing bastard. Which is why I'm so often late coming, back from wherever I went. God, you know, Rum, tell me which way to go. Remind me again of the Hawaii Five-0. Affirm with me, O oh Lord. The thing to do is sit back and put up my hand in order to. Circa then. The orchestration becomes uncertain. Circa memory. Piccolo and clarinet pairings sputter. Every footfall like a dropped heartbeat. And another curtain falls between heartbeats. As a bassoon makes a sound that is not encouraging. Is an election a feat? The last and third act seems concerned with death. Or fate or a crime to some who see an imposition. Or at least the tenor is assembling a coffin. What is your position? He sings of ships bound for Cyprus at dawn. The drifting clouds. And closer to home of glorious college days. Quitting college just to play basketball every day in a noon pickup league with guys who had names like Big Ugly Jim. Say no to Harper. We all hide something. Barker. Darker. Prorogation doesn't work for the nation. East fan alive. The drive. Thrive. I'm running to know. It was all edited out. What do you know? But it's interesting. May 2nd. He was to say he'd never been in love. May 2nd. But holding a kitchen knife. 
May after May Day. Shamefully reveal that he may we all came close between clouds. Go with courage to loving a fembot to support. Build in a basement laboratory our community by miraculo unity. Basso profundo. Miraculo. The flickering self. Could not fool the tenor. Forgive me.